hey guys, listen, I try to go live, it wouldn't allow it, oh, I just about got hit by a car, uh, it wouldn't allow it, um, I'm sorry that this is me walking right now, please God, please help me, please do not let these things happen to me. Maybe I should turn and go back. Just past a couple of people. I think I know. And I'm trying to just stay out of their way. Um, anyways, I love you guys. Um, I've been really researching stuff about the alien deception. How their are demons, fallen angels. And I've been not researching on the internet. I've been doing it in the Bible. And some on the internet. About people who claim to be a duck, you know, a duck, a duffy, a duffies, whatever you want to call them. But they all say that they have took them and they have a baby with them and impregnate them. And then they, uh, after that, they don't carry the baby for nine months like we do, and they call them a certain name. They call them something between the mixture of alien and humans. They also like to refer to them as humanoids, if that makes sense. Um, anyways, if you do your research in the Bible, you will find these things mentioned so much. Those without soul, garments, um, spotted flesh, stuff like that. <laughs> the Leviathans. If you look into all of that, it goes on and on. And you reference it to other key factors, you start to see the story. And the story is this that a lot of them are walking among us and living daily as if, uh, crap. But they are living daily. Just like you and me. And what they do is, they are murderers. They kill people and take over their form and their lives. Kind of like the host. Um, like the body snatchers. Uh, I have a lot more to prove with all of this. With Bible, scripture, with none other than you know, our Heavenly Father's words, God's words. I just want to say, I will be doing videos to prove this and showing you how I came about it. I will also do a couple more lives. Also, um, if you haven't noticed, there has been the impeachment done and Trump's supposed to be coming before trial. I hope and pray no one worries that much about that because it's a distraction, guys. We need to keep our heads above the distractions. I'm very close to the road. It is literally right there. I have no friends. I have very have maybe one or two and they are on YouTube um, <coughs> just a couple of good people that I've met that are there for me and talk to me um guys I'm worried I'm very worried people don't know what it's like to be hungry or starve 
That'd be so hungry. You can't walk. You can't move. Your strength is gone. People don't understand that. People don't understand what it's like to be so thirsty. You got you would drink water out of a nasty creek for just a sense of belief, even though it's bad and you know something's wrong with it. This world is all about to turn upside down. And I hope and I pray that y'all all know what I'm talking about. I will be explaining this with scripture. Not just scripture either. Testimonies from people. Um, I do not have anybody that really wants to come on my channel. People are too scared because of all the harassment from the other the evil group of people. So people are too scared to come forward. But um, I am God's little warrior. <laughs> they can do what they want to me. Because I will keep putting it out there. I'm not scared of them. I'm not scared of the occult. I'm not scared of anything evil in this world. God says, fear nothing. No one. Only fear him. And I'm going to leave it with that. Pray for me, guys. It's rough. It's very rough out here. It's so cold. Um, pray for my family and